What's up guys? So I wanted to create this video for all the EMS studio owners. That's electric muscle stimulation. Sales, EMS sales. So I hear this all the time. We had this at our studios too at the beginning. Um, and it was cool at the beginning because, you know, um, EMS was new back in the day. We brought it in like, what now, eight years ago? And there was no EMS studios at all whatsoever in the United States. So it was completely new. So we could use the electric muscle stimulation as a sales point. We could basically say that we have something that nobody else has in the whole US, right? But now the market is getting really saturated and there's so many EMS studios and everybody used it. And we even have uh, people opening up right next to all of our studios who have similar machines to ours and they say they have better and all that kind of stuff, right? So let them ride that angle that they try to say, yeah, we have this, we have that, it's better, whatever. But the point is, why are pl uh, clients here, right? Don't get too hang up on that. So what I'm trying to say, we don't even mention electric muscle stimulation. Maybe we talk about it for like one to two minutes out of a 45 minute consultation. Sometimes it's an hour consultation and we talk like one to two minutes about the actual machine, right? So what do we talk about? About the clients. So we try to find out everything possibly we can. Listen, 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 listen. 80% they are talking and 20% we are talking. And then we connect the dots and we figure out how we can help them. Sometimes we can't even help them, then they are our clients, we send them away. We are more than happy to send them to the competition, right? Go ahead, train with them. But unless, you know, of course, they need more help, then we send them to somewhere else to the right way. But the point is, do not get hanged up on the electric muscle stimulation, which is the how, how we are getting there, right? It's, it's just a tool. We are in a gym, right? We have lots of equipment and everything. We even tell our clients when they come in or during consultation that when, especially when they bring up, you know, competition or anything like that, we would bring up, well, why do you even bring up electric muscle stimulation? Yeah, it's a cool concept, but let me just ask you this. Why are you actually here today? What's your why? What's the actual reason? And how can I be a better trainer for you? Because it sounds like you have tried other things. So it's just really getting deep and find out that what's different right now? Why are they really here? and what they want to get out of this whole thing, right? Because if they say most of the time, I want to lose weight, I want to get fit, I want to tone up, I want to whatever, 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 right? So, okay, so now we got it. So let me, let me give you a different analogy. So you're a travel agent and you have a client comes in and it says, I want to go to Thailand, okay? So you're gonna talk about the Thailand, what they're going to get in the package, right? Like how amazing Thailand is, how amazing the hotel, the service, what they're gonna get, how they're gonna feel, emotions and all those things, right? You're probably gonna spend no time whatsoever on how they are going to get to Thailand. So why would you talk about, the, oh, you're gonna take this airplane that's gonna take you there and this is the airplane that's so nice, blah, 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 blah. No, they talk about the actual experience, what they're gonna get, the emotions, and what's gonna happen when they get there, right? Same here. Why would you talk about electric muscle stimulation when that's just a tool that's going to get them there? What you're going to talk about is how they are going to feel when they get there, how they're going to get there, as in like all the other concepts, because just electric muscle stimulation won't get them there. So build up the whole plan, give them basically a trailer of what they're going to get, like a good movie, and then at the end come up with an actual plan, show them the plan, this is what we're gonna do, I'm gonna sign here, you're gonna sign here, let's commit to it, not a contract, just an actual plan, sheet of paper, because people, clients, trust a person with a plan. So just by having that, you already stand out a little bit more. But my point is, that do not get hanged up on electric muscle stimulation because that's just a tool that's helping them to get there. Again, you should not get hanged up because the market is gonna get so saturated. There will be fake machines, there will be crappy machines, illegal machines, there will be so many other machines and legal machines too. So there will be like, now I believe three, four, I think we're reaching five FDA cleared uh, devices now on the market. So the point is they will be popping up everywhere and if you get hanged up on, yeah, we have electric muscle stimulation, you're gonna lose because what are they coming here for? And that is results. Now, how do you get that results? If all you have to say is electric muscle stimulation, you're already lost. So, find out about them. Why are they really here? What are they looking to get out of this whole situation? Why they, did they even hear about electric muscle stimulation when they came into your studio? In our case, most people come in because they heard about our results, right? And they don't even know what electric muscle stimulation is. 
So that's a good thing because we don't depend on solely on one single machine. We depend on our results and services that we give out. So in your case, why are they coming in here? And then find out why they are so hang up on electromagnetic stimulation, right? So then find out why they're actually here. In our case, we dig deep, we find out their why. Lots of times they cry in throughout consultations and that's one of our goals in a good way, you know? And then once we have all of those things, then we analyze it and then we tell them you might not even going to use electric muscle stimulation. We might going to do our core program and we're going to do conventional training and then once a week maybe you do also EMS. So if you just try to sell and sell and sell EMS, again, you're going to have such a hard time in the future. So you should think about that. But anyways, the number one is analyze the actual person. Why are they here first? Once you have that, find out why, what they have done before also find out why they haven't got the results, right? Because they're here for a reason and they're gonna try to, you know, beat you down that, oh, is this really work and everything? And, you know, you just have to go push back and forth, but obviously what you have been doing has not been working. So you're here now and it's gonna be different this time. You're obviously coming from the bottom of the barrel because they don't believe in this. That's one second. The, on top of that, they have tried so many things so they don't know if this is going to work. So you have lots of work to do. So when they come in, if you want long, long clients, if you want clients who stay here forever, then you have to do all of these things. Otherwise, there is no point. So then, you break all this down. We come up with an actual plan, a realistic plan. We readjust, we adjust, and then also figure it out where they are right now mentally. Try to break everything down. Try to make them understand why they haven't lost the weight, if that was their goal, you know, before, and how they, how we are going to do it differently. That now they are going to lose the weight, and it, electromagnetic stimulation might not even come up in the whole conversation, because that's again just a tool. I mean, I don't see you talk about the squat rack, the dumbbells, you know, the bench. You could talk about it that too. Electromagnetic stimulation, just another equipment in a fitness studio. So don't get too hanged up on it again. Okay. Once you learn that and you focus on the actual person instead of what you. You are selling, uh, then you're going to win. Because number one is that you need to sell something that they need. Let me give you an example. If you, let's say for me, I don't care about you know what amenities maybe a studio has, and I experienced this before. I walk in and they try to walk me through the whole gym when I, go, when I want to sign up, and then I and they just don't talk about what I actually need, you know. And then at the end, they just keep listing, oh, we have this, we have that, and that, da, 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 and showers, and that. And I was like, I really don't care. What I need is X, Y, and Z, and you didn't even show it to me. So the same thing. Lots of people come in, sit down, you have a talk, you talk about yourself, how amazing you are. Well, of course you are, but the point is, they might not care, they might not even know what you're talking about. What they really care about is, can you help me? Can you get me there? Those are the questions that you need to answer and then you have to break it down how you're going to do that and not talking about, oh yeah, our machine is so great and blah, 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 blah. What you need to figure out again is how you're going to help them, how you're going to get them and this is why we guarantee the results or their money back because we really dig deep and we take people that we can help and get the results that they need. So you should probably develop a sales process. Our sales training is days and days of training and ongoing education. Every week we have one hour of sales training minimum um, with our team, with everybody together. But we are ramping that up even more. But the point is, it's not about the machine, it's about the client. And you have to figure it out, you have to break it down and you really have to show them that why you're different for them and how you're actually going to get them those results.